Hi, I'm Jennifer Chen and I'm a clinical assistant professor here at Stanford Medicine. Today we're going to be talking about how to approach a patient with a facial rash. There's also a cystic lesion and multiple closed comedones along the medial cheeks, the nose, forehead, and temples. Although rosacea typically would be distributed more over the central face, um, namely the medial cheeks, nose, forehead, and chin, which is not the distribution we're seeing here. So in summary, acne and rosacea are both chronic inflammatory diseases that are very common. While acne presents with comedones, rosacea presents more with papules and pustules without comedones. Uh, rosacea also tends to affect the central face the flush areas of the skin, while acne can be much more widespread. Rosacea tends to come episodically, and common triggers include things like uh, sun, heat, strong emotions, alcohol, caffeine, um, and uh, spicy foods. When looking at a patient with rosacea, make sure you also evaluate for ocular rosacea you need to look for conjunctival injection and screen for a gritty sensation in the eye or a foreign body sensation in the eye. So acne and rosacea have a lot of differences and hopefully after today, you'll be better able to distinguish between the two. Thank you for your time. And for more information, please go to the Stanford 25 website. The preceding program is copyrighted by the Board of Trustees of the Leland Stanford Junior University please visit us at med.stanford.edu.